How long do I come from Cardiff? The Hilton Cardiff was the next stop after Bristol on our road trip. It is still the only Hilton Group hotel in Wales, although a Garden Inn is announced to open in early 2021 in Northern Wales. But that's a different topic. This hotel, with its 197 bedrooms and entitled as the glitziest hotel in Cardiff, has an amazing location next to the City Hall with a direct view onto Cardiff Castle. In a Wales online article about the 12 most expensive hotel rooms in Wales, the presidential suite of the Hilton Cardiff was on the list. Sufficient reason for us not to do things by halves and take the presidential suite. There was a nice opportunity to use the upgrade request functionality and the price was reasonable so we tried that out. The day before check-in we received a call to confirm that we really want to proceed with this request. Without any doubts, I confirmed and looked forward to an amazing experience. Before we have our room tour, we step by the executive lounge next to the presidential suite. Pretty nice location so that you don't have to walk too far. For the time being, the lounge was closed, but there was an alternative area in a part of the restaurant dedicated to executive guests. We will walk by later on. Back to the experience. We were asked the day before for our arrival time, so I said around 2 p.m. We were confirmed that the room would be ready by then in any case. Of course, it was not. We arrived at 1.30 p.m. and waited until 2.15. And when we arrived at the room, this was what we encountered. An open door and a broken seal. The shift leader told us that she double-checked the room herself and she would be very sorry for forgetting to put the seal back on and close the door. Not exactly sure what the seal is for if anyone can take it off and put it back to the liking. Anyway. We wouldn't be who we are if we didn't do things to the maximum. So besides the sweet upgrade, there was another upgrade request possibility I selected. The romance package. It consists of a bottle of champagne, chocolate dipped strawberries and rose petals on the bed. Wow! Amazing for a great room tour! However, when I received the room is ready SMS, I was informed that roses and fruits are unavailable in Cardiff, so we are limited to champagne and some chocolates. Well, Okay, the effect is not the same and our fans won't like that, but what to do? At least the price was reduced accordingly. I'm a little bit disappointed since for the total price for room and package, I really would expect someone walking to the next flower store and buy two roses to get some petals. I really appreciate it when things which are offered are actually available. Blaming the current situation for everything is not quite fair. But let's come to the positive side. The champagne was really great and the chocolates were also very nicely decorated and tasted very well. And after a bottle of champagne, the mood is rising quite fast again. The last downside in this room was the window cleanliness. Of course we can blame the current situation again for soiled windows, but uh, yeah. In general the fun is limited if you cannot really enjoy this view, which would be wonderful if the windows were clean. And these were still halfway okay. Those in the living room were totally opaque. While we see the bathroom with the last of the 134 square meters, Having a jacuzzi bathtub, a TV on the wall and a walk-in shower. One more side info about the hotel. The parking is not directly at the hotel but one street away. As I already mentioned, we arrived a bit earlier and the front desk agent described as the way to the parking lot. Not so easy to find, 
and the first time we passed it and did a lap of honor. To be honest, not the nicest parking garage we've been to. Moreover, she refused to take our luggage into custody, since there would be no space for that. So we put it back to the car, drove 200 meters away, walked back, waited for the room, received the confirmation of the room being ready, walked back to the car during heavy rain, and came back with the luggage. Wet. This is exactly what you imagine when you book one of the 12 most expensive hotel rooms in Wales. By the way, when double checking the room, the duty manager probably oversaw the bottle of water in the fridge. At least uh, the bottle was stuck there, so it obviously was there for a longer time. And the actual bottles of water are in a different compartment. But who needs water when you can have champagne? So let's have a look onto the executive lunch substitute, which was really very nice. A corner where you could order drinks and a large table with different snacks such as nachos and small salads. We were first here so it was still empty, but it became absolutely full in time. Directly next to it was the restaurant area where we had dinner. The last strange thing, then I stop it. On the notice for breakfast, they forgot the time slot between 10 past 10 and 10 to 11. But we conclude with the positive sides. Dinner, lounge and breakfast were absolutely great and... Okay, I was drunk after the champagne, but I had a lot of fun telling everybody which room we had. The presidential suite. For the Hilton Cardiff, we award 3.5 out of 5 diamonds. Too many compromises for one of the 12 most expensive rooms in Wales. Thank you and goodbye. You're Alex from Gaia Dreams.